Hey guys, so it's about time for an update and today is just not my day. It's just not my day. I started off with 11 neon yellows and I can only see three right now and I don't know what happened to the rest. I completely shrimp proofed my filter so I don't think they're in there especially the giant female that I had she was like an inch long and I can't find her anywhere so I don't know if they're hiding or if they're dead oh here's another one or what but um I'm a little worried but I don't wanna like go looking for them in the tank so I guess I'll just keep an eye out for them in the next couple of days so this is my tank right now um, I just added some anacris today and I wrapped it around the spray bar of my filter because I just didn't like the way that it looked just floating so I'm hoping it'll be okay like that and if it grows maybe it'll slow down some of the flow from the filter which I'm okay with because shrimp don't really like a fast flowing filter anyway but um my water sprite has been doing really well maybe too well because this entire like frond grew within the past couple of days from the base like it was like an inch long the last time I saw it and then this Amazon sword I had to trim off um, three or four leaves because it was just getting really big really fast I did pluck off some of the babies from the water sprite because I noticed that some of the leaves are kind of starting to brown so I might just take this entire thing out after it gets kind of crazy and just let the little baby ones grow and then my Anubia has been doing so well it's like sprouted a new leaf right here this one that one right there is brand new it just unfurled the other day and I was so excited to see it because that means that it's not dying and then there's another one I don't know if you can see that it's right there and that one is still curled up so that should be unfurling pretty soon um, my runner on my dwarf Sagittaria I think is what it's called is getting pretty long there's another one in between the two big ones this one and that one it's like right in between and yeah everything seems to be doing really well the only issue I'm having is I have a lot of nitrates in the tank. I've been having to do water changes like once every day or every other day because there's just so much nitrate. There is never any ammonia. It's always at zero or zero. Nitrites are always at zero, but my nitrates are like growing ridiculously high every day. So that's kind of the reason why I added the anacris because it's supposed to be a nitrate sponge and be able to help with bringing that number down but I'm still gonna you know test the water daily and do water changes when necessary but hopefully things will be a little bit more stable really Yeah, he was trying to totally drink out of the tank earlier, but realized that it has a lid and couldn't stick his mouth into the hole. Such a troublemaker. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, this is pretty much um, where it's at right now. I've been constantly trying to maintain it and keep things trimmed and things like that. And... Yeah, I guess I'll update you guys in another few days. Hopefully I will find my big mama shrimp and things will be A-OK. -okay. Oh, look at the two little babies. Poor guy, he's been carrying the other one around for like the past 
couple of hours. So hope you guys enjoyed that update and make sure you click the subscribe button if you guys want to see more videos. Thanks!